Hope you want See room. Charger. Why can't it plug in? Face washer. Okay. My sister got me some cute little Valentine's hair tips. Here's the cute one. Let's see what temperature it is. It's really cold outside. Yesterday it was like hot. Oh yeah, no, it's cold. Don't think I'll be going outside today.
Yeah. Shirt stuff. This is my sister's. Head. On my shirt. Time for the pants. Okay, got them on. Hair time. Make sure it's even 
thinly pancaked and I don't know why it's called pancake but it just is but yeah you do that um, for both sides then I'm just going to take a section of hair and I'm just going to clip it away and what you're going to do with those two sections up front is take them in the back and just tie them with a hair tie well clear elastic because you want it to be small and then you're just going to take that hair you clipped away put it back down and it looks like this it is super cute you could do dutch braids but you're probably in a hurry in the morning to get to school so braids are the way to go and i just love the way it looks you can even part your hair and yeah it still looks cute so that's hairstyle number two hairstyle number three you're going to put your hair up into a ponytail and then you're going to split your ponytail into two sections so then i just twist my sections of hair around my finger and then you're going to tie a knot. So you're going to cross your sections, create an X, and then just take one of the sections and just flip them up, over, and through that little opening we created. Do the same thing in the back. Just, it's a knot, create a knot, and then tie it tight with your ends hanging out. Twist them, and you're just going to wrap them around that, the base of the bun and do it as many times you need to. Then you're just going to hold on to the bun, take a hair tie, and pull it over. Um, you can see here I didn't pull it all the way over and it ended up getting caught a little bit so I had to kind of rearrange that hair tie and then I just kind of pinch and pulled, pulled some hair out in front. This is like the perfect bun. This is way cuter than the buns I wore back in high school so and it only takes like a minute or two to do. Style number four, my favorite low bun ever. Do your hair like you're doing a ponytail bun. The last time, pull your hair tight over your ponytail a little bit to form a small bun. You want a small bun, not a droopy bun. With your ends hanging out, split them into two, twist them around your finger, bring them up over the bun, tie them, and then you're just gonna, there's a little opening there, so you take the ends, you flip them under and up through to do. Uh, so what I've been seeing, a lot of people doing these like pen tricks. Thank you. 